The Banyana Banyana players were in a jovial mood at the team hotel as they lined up for a team photo. The team had a rest day on Saturday after all players arrived in New Zealand where they will play all their three Group G matches. The players have put behind them a tough week and the mood is high with their focus now on the tournament. The spirit in the team is very high, uh, the bond is just amazing and uh, we've missed playing football so much so when we got on the field it was just enjoyment. It feels great. Um, I think today was a nice start-up session for all of us. Um, I think you could have seen all the excitement that we had, you know, touching the ball again. And yeah, it's been a tough week, but um, I'm glad that we're back here and we're ready to get the ball rolling. The team had its first official training session at the Ole Football Academy in Porirua in rainy conditions. Training in the rain will help the players get used to playing in those conditions ahead of their World Cup matches. One player who enjoyed training in the rainy weather is Scotland-based midfielder Linda Mochalo. Before we left South Africa, our manager told us that uh, the weather is going to be wet and uh, it's going to rain, so we were prepared for that. And I think for me personally, uh, playing on the rain, it's, it's amazing. You never get tired really. The team will use Saturday's international friendly against Costa Rica to fine-tune their tactics. We know that obviously our last couple weeks have been all training and um, it would be nice to you know, get another game under our belts just so we can fine-tune some things and obviously work on some tactics for Sweden. Um, but obviously Costa Rica is going to be another challenge for us. But we're ready. Um, we've worked so hard over the last couple of weeks, months. Um, leading up to this. So yeah, I think everyone's just ready to get going. Banyana Banyana's goal is to reach the knockout stage of the tournament for the first time after making their first World Cup appearance in France four years ago. Pesinkato, SABC News.